today I'm gonna be installing a uh, trailer dolly. Uh, basically, it's a uh, dolly to help me, you know, turn around my trailer. So with the trailer dolly, uh, I can utilize my lawnmower as well. I can attach my lawnmower up to the trailer dolly, which the trailer dolly would then tra attach to the actual trailer, and I can use my lawnmower to spin my uh, trailer around as well. Now I'm not gonna be doing a lot of talking, so it's just gonna be all visual. So this is gonna be outside because it's got the stem. It doesn't stay right or left. Alright, so I'm just sorting out my uh, washers, pins, screws, got our chain with the cotter pin. Yep. Got our ball joint, a washer. These washers are going to go to the wheel. Oh my yeah, so it's going to be a washer. And then we take one of these pins and we feed it through. It's honestly the way it says. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Bent the pin back so that way. Does it come loose? Do the other side. Where did you imagine it? How did you get that in there? Alright. Wash it on. Pin going through. Straight through. Then we have to bend Got that portion we're gonna lay it back down ball joint on which ball joint is gonna go like so here let's take the nut off I'm gonna get the terminology messed up but I believe it's a crescent washer So basically this bolt is supposed to go here at the bottom like that. So it's kind of confusing. Alright, bigger bolt, bigger washer, bigger nut. There we go. Now we're This is your guide pin, then this is your supposed to be cotter pin. I can 
be messing up the terminology. And that's that. Now let's tighten that now. Let's see what is that on these baby. Let's try the 17 again. Yep, it's a 17. Part out. Uh, it's got a cotta pin on it too. Lock down. Now let's pump it up with some air. Again, the heavier the trailer, the bit more difficult it will be. However, it's much easier, you know, in comparison to lifting it this bad boy up. That's a pain. Yeah, it's the trailer dolly. Trailer is now 